Now, apart from those two divisions, we can call it, they're also fake medicines. <laughs> and they've continued to uh, plague Africa. And so to what extent is that a problem? And uh, what are you doing it's as Imperial Logistics to, to fight fake medicines? It, it is beyond belief, Derek. So across the globe, it's estimated that just on 1% of all medicines are either fake or substandard. Fake means there's somebody with a criminal factory that's manufacturing product with a fake box or a counterfeit product. Substandard means the factories are not actually producing quality product. That 1% of global market, that's a lot of money. That's a big business. And so there's a lot of people who do really well out of it and are very focused on it. So we spend a lot of time as Imperial Logistics running with the advocacy work of getting people to be aware of how big a problem it is, getting our partners to be aware of how big a problem it is, and then putting in the capability within our businesses to be able to monitor and manage it. And so putting in means of tracking and, and, and verifying the authentication of product. Yeah, I'm just sort of uh, reading that there's a lot of responsibility that uh, comes with this business. Yeah, because what we do matters, right? There's a patient at the end of our supply chain every time. And either the product is not there or it is there. Either the product no. is genuine or it's fake. It's very binary. And if you're not doing it right, there's somebody who's not going to get the care that they deserve and require.